Welcome back to another Ken's Outdoors. Today I'm going to be doing another video, and in today's video, I'm going to be doing a little bit of a vloggish type video. Right now I'm in Walmart, um, and I'm looking at the Plano boxes. I was thinking about getting one of these Ozark trail boxes, but I don't like the way to clip this. Well, the thing right here is to like clip to close it. I don't like how it's made. It looks kind of cheaply made, so I'm going to go ahead and spend the extra 40 cents to get this Plano box. I already have some of these Plano boxes and they work extremely well. So we're definitely going to pick this up. Um, I'm looking at the tackle right now. I'm seriously thinking about picking up one of these um, Strike King KVD Sexy Dogs. And if I do get one, it's going to be in the, um, I think that's a Sexy Shad right there. Yeah, that's a Sexy Shad color, but I don't know. I might get one in this color right here if I get the bigger size. I don't know guys comment down below whether y'all think I should get one are they worth the price have any of y'all caught any good size bass on them I don't know leave a comment down below I might pick one up in my next video but I'm gonna keep looking at the tackle here and see if I find anything I want to pick up okay guys so I'm been staying here looking at the hooks for about two or three minutes now and they do not have no uh, octopus hooks for Senkos well not that I see uh, they do have some gamagatsu. The only pack they do have is in size 8, and that's way too little for wacky rigging. So, I don't know, guys. Comment down below on um, what other hook y'all would say is good for wacky rigging Senkos. I don't know. I don't see any octopus hooks. But just comment down below, guys. I don't know. Okay, so I'm on the way home now. Uh, I decided to get one of these Plano boxes. Uh, it was like 4 11 and that was with tax. So not a bad price for a good box. These hold up really well. I've got one of them already at the house, and I got four other boxes that came with the um, tackle bag that I bought. And I got me this um, Rip Rolls candy. These things are really good, but that's really not fishing related. But yeah, we're on the way home now. Um, when I get home, I'm going to unbox the, well, unpackage the uh, baits I got from at Berkeley County Bass Boys, and I'm going to show y'all a new rod and reel I got, so get back to y'all when I get to the house. Okay, so right now we're going to unpackage the baits that my sponsor, Berkeley County Bass Boys, sent to me. If y'all ever want to see me any kind of fan mail or anything like that right there, even just a letter, it don't even have to be baits, just send it to that address right there, and I'll open it up on camera and give y'all a shout out, but now you see what they sent me. Okay, so here's the stuff they sent me. Um, they sent me some Senkos in some different colors. Um, they sent me three packs. Um, the first pack we got here is Ghost Candy. And this is my personal favorite color right here. Just look at this color. It's a really nice looking color. It's just like a blackish with all... Well, no, it's like a gray kind of clear color with all colors of flakes in it. It's a really nice looking color. I'm really excited to fish with these. Um, and the next color we got here is called Mystery. And the reason they call it mystery is because they don't have a name for it yet. I suggested they name it banana seed or like chartreuse candy or chartreuse pepper. What do y'all guys think they should name this co this color right here? Comment in the comment in the comments down below a name for that color. They'll be looking because I'm gonna tell them to look in the comments of this video. But yeah, the next color I got is June bug. I'll actually be giving these away in my giveaway. I'm going to be having a giveaway here very, very soon because we're getting close to 800 subscribers. Well, not really. Right now, we're at 700 subscribers. Well, maybe not even quite to 700 yet, but I don't know. I'm going to have a 800 subscriber giveaway and then another giveaway when I reach 1,000 subscribers. So make sure y'all be looking out for that because I'll be giving these um, awesome Cinco's right here away. But yeah. Make sure y'all go check out Berkeley County Bass Boys. Um, I'll have their website link in the description. They also have an awesome YouTube channel. They do some awesome videos. Make sure y'all go check their, their YouTube channel out. I'll put the name of it up on the screen right now. And check out their Instagram. But, and before I go fishing, because right now I'm about to leave and go fishing at a pond right here from my house that I've caught a few nice bass out of in the past. Um, and I'm going to take y'all guys along with me. Um, see if I can't catch a few fish on camera. And I'm going to be using my new pole I just bought the other day. This right here is an Abba Garcia Silver Max spinning reel. As y'all can see, it says right there, Silver Max. The glare's on it. And, I'm a bit, and I bought a Berkeley Cherrywood HD rod. And this is the 7-foot version. But yeah, this is a nice little combo, I would say, I put together. Um, but yeah... It work, it's been working pretty good. 
Um, I've caught a few bass on it already. It handles pretty good, so I don't know. If, I'm gonna have to fish with it a little bit longer to see how see how good it performs. A couple fish don't tell you really much. I got to hang a big one on it first to really know how it handles. But yeah, about to go fishing now and see if we can't get us a big one. So next time y'all see me, I'll be at the pond. So I made it to the pond. It's not the biggest pond, but it's a pretty good size. I know there's some nice size bass in here. There's a couple three and four pounders. I've seen them swimming around the edges. But yeah, I'm about to get fishing here. I'm a, got my whopper plopper tied on and about to see if I can't catch a bass. I got the first bass of the day. Well, actually the second. I did catch one off camera, but it was a little dink, so I ain't gonna put it in the video. But nice little bass right there. Caught him on the whopper plopper. Go ahead and get the release on him here. Yeah, so let's see if we can't get us another one. He followed it up, and I stopped it right at the bank and jerked it one time, and he completely hammered it. So they definitely like the bait, I think. So let's keep fishing, see if we can't get us another one. Okay, we got the third bass of the day, counting that dink I caught that I didn't put on camera. But yeah, they're just completely hammering the whopper plopper. This is the second cast after I caught that one. I just, that uh, second fish I caught. So three casts, two fish, that ain't bad. Baby, we can keep up the streak. I'll go ahead and get the hooks out of this one and get the release on him. But yeah, guys, this is going to be the end of the video. Make sure y'all drop a like if y'all enjoyed this video. Um, comment down below whether y'all like these vloggish type videos. Um, but I'm going to end on this note saying that me and Berkeley County Bass Boys, we teamed together to make this awesome looking color card called Hard Candy. It's an amazing looking color. I'll put a picture of it on the screen right now. But yeah, like I said, the name of that color is Hard Candy. And it's just a really amazing looking color. If you want to pick up some of those Cinco's, make sure you go over to his Instagram, Facebook, or any kind of social media that they have and just message them. Because I don't know if they have this color up on their site yet. They'll probably put it on their site very, very soon. But right now, you'll have to go to them and message them on Instagram and tell them you want that color. But yeah, make sure if y'all do order something, make sure you tell them who sent you Ken's Outdoors. It'll help me a lot. And go check out my other sponsors, um, Catch em Lures, TTG Lures. Um, but like I said, this is going to be the end of the video. I do want to tell y'all one more thing. I'm going to be doing a challenge here soon on... Uh, a challenge here soon of where I'm going to be fishing with baits that I found while I was fishing. So far, this is what the box is looking like. I found way more lures than this. I just haven't put them in here yet. But I found out the other day fishing. I found out about two weeks ago. And I found these hooks when I was catfishing. These are some really cool looking hooks I found. Just look at that hook right there. Look at that big circle hook. But yeah, um, just wanted to let y'all know that. Um, but yeah. And another thing is, don't y'all, I don't know whether y'all watched that video or not, but they, uh, I don't know if y'all remember the catfish bubblegum I won a giveaway from Oki Catfishing. I got tired of it being in that little plastic container, so I put it in a mason jar. And I just like peeled the label off and put the label on here. And that $8.99 was already written on top, or $8.97, but I don't know. I just got tired of it being in that little plastic container container it liked to leak a lot if you turned it over but yeah this is gonna be the end of the video make sure y'all drop a like comment subscribe turn on your notifications but until next time hope you have some good fishing